Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a review of the Makeup Revolution One Pound lipsticks. I have got six in my collection, and I've had a few of them for a while now, so I kind of have I've road tested them, and I know how they last and how they feel on the lips. So I thought I'd give you a rundown of the ones I've got, show you swatches, and tell you my recommendations. One of my newest ones in my collection is the one I'm wearing on my lips, and this is a part of their Scandalous collection, and this is in the colour Depraved. This is the one for the faint hearted and do not get me wrong, I will not be going out in this. This is just for the video. <laughs> I don't think I have the balls to pull this off. It's a gorgeous colour but I don't think I could. No. But this is the colour. It is the most gorgeous, like true purple colour. It is beautiful. However, this is the one I am most disappointed with out of the six I've got. I thought this would apply to lips really opaque really quickly but it doesn't it's quite you need to build it up to get to this color when I first tried this it was actually quite streaky I'll just swatch some of my hand now and I don't know whether it was just the film over the lipstick but that's it but it is it's such a beautiful color like I said I don't know if I'd wear this out but yeah this is definitely beautiful if you want to branch out into sort of purplies and you don't want to spend a lot of money on it, definitely grab one of these. Like I said, they're a pound. If you don't like it, it's not the end of the world. I do like it, but I won't be going out on it. The next colour also from the Scandalous collection is the colour Crime. And this is my first kind of foray into like bright pink lipsticks. And I adore this. This one, unlike the... Are you called Depraved? Depraved. This one dries quite matte on me. And I don't know if it's meant to do that. But again, it is the most gorgeous pink. Look at that. And I do. I'm, I'm brave enough to wear this outside. I absolutely adore this colour. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. For the summer, slap this on and it's just... Oh, it is absolutely gorgeous, this one is. The next colour is one of the first ones I ordered. And this is the lipstick in Luscious. This one is completely out of my comfort zone. But again, just like all of them, they are absolutely beautiful in colour. They are all, they just all go on really, really beautiful. They're so opaque. They're just, oh. This one looks a bit streaky on my hand, actually, but it's not in real life. They're all, all the ones I've got anyway, none of them are shimmer. They're all cream. And they, they just last, especially that pink, the um, crime. They last so well on my lips. For one pound lipstick, you just can't ask for more. But yeah, this is luscious, and it's just the most beautiful orange a true orange and it's absolutely stunning next is a color i ordered because i don't own any and i was like i need to get a color like this and you might have just seen it oops and that is this color in lady and it is a bright pillar box red this is more out of my comfort zone than bright pinks i don't know what it is i don't know but it, it's beautiful i haven't worn it out yet i've only kind of tested it on my lips i haven't actually worn it properly Mainly because I don't have a lip liner and I feel like I need a lip liner with this. But look at that, it's, it's stunning. It is just the most gorgeously opaque pillar box red. It is absolutely beautiful. I said I don't know the wear on this because I haven't worn it, I'll be honest. But it is, all of them colours together look so pretty, don't they? But this is definitely such a pretty red. If you want to get into reds like I'm trying to, try one of these because, like I said, it's gorgeous. The next one is from one of their other collections, and I can't think what it's called. I think I want to call it like it's a vamp collection. It's like the darker colours. And this is Rebel with Cause, which is meant to be a dupe for Max Rebel. I don't own it, so I can't compare it. But it is the most... Oh, everything, everything's the most gorgeous. It's just a really, really pretty deep burgundy red. I haven't worn this out again. I'm saving this for the winter. This is definitely a winter shade, but... Oh, it's just oh, such beautiful, like really deep wine. Oh, such a pretty colour. It's definitely a lot lighter. Are you broken? Oh! What have I done? It's broken. This is the only thing with them, and I can't moan because they're one pound. But the quality isn't amazing but it's one pound and it's not going to be 
matte quality packaging. They spent the money on the product rather than the packaging and I completely get that. But this is broken. Like the lids are. This one sounds really strong because it's broken. Wibbly wobbly, wibbly wobbly. Anyway, back to the colour. Yeah, it's beautiful. And last but not least in my collection, I went, uh oh. I got lipstick on my dress. Purple lipstick on my dress. Uh. Anyway, as I was saying, the last colour in my collection, they were really bright, so I was like, I have to choose a nude. And this is the colour, the one. And it is like this. Just watch it there. It is such a lovely, opaque, beigey colour. On my lips, I have to admit, it's not the greatest. I've got really dry lips, but I find the rest of them go on really well and cover that. This accentuates it a little bit more. Again, they are absolutely beautiful. And doesn't my hair look so pretty? And so does my dress and my legs. But yeah, I absolutely... Run down of these. They are fabulous. I haven't tried one I don't like. Some of them are a bit harder to work with. And they're a bit harder, I mean, as in, I've got to go and pat it with my finger, which isn't a big deal. But for a pound, you just can't go wrong. There's 30 shades in the collection. So for £30, you can get the whole collection if you wish. My next time I definitely order, I'm getting some more. They're just... Just look at them together. These look so pretty. I love the fact the packaging got the colours on top. Because like MAC lipsticks, I'm sure you're aware they don't have the colour on, they got the names. So it's just a pain when you want to find the colour, whereas these you just you know exactly what you want and you can put it out straight away. So definitely final thoughts on them. They are worth every pound that they're worth. They're for the formula they are crazy that they just cost a pound. Yeah, packaging isn't amazing, but for the formula who cares on packaging? You have to be very careful on your handbag because the lids do come off. I've lost this one rolling on the ground before, so yeah, be very careful with the lids. But there goes one on the floor. And the lid didn't come off because that's the broken one. But apart from that, they are definitely worth every single pound that they cost. As in every single, as in mean, as in one pound. So that is my review of the Makeup Revolution one pound lipsticks done. I really hope you enjoyed this video and it was informative. Out of my six, the one I recommend the most, I love Luscious. It's just something I would never buy, but it is just the most beautiful colour, especially for the summer. I know we're coming towards the end of it now, but I would definitely recommend if there's one you have to try it, I would say Luscious. And yeah, that's the video done. I really hope you enjoyed this. Please like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time for another video. Bye. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is a very exciting video because I've got a big collection.